What's up? It's Ghostatron. I'm back for part two of my switch to hardcore. On my quest to fight the Ender Dragon for the first time, the second time. Anyways, so the Connoisseur Cove. I'm gonna start with that. Uh, that's the cave or cove at my house where I add people who subscribe and leave a nice comment. I added someone the last episode. Um, I have not uploaded anything since then, and I don't get a lot of comments. So, yeah, I can't add anyone right this second. So, I guess Gavin might be the last person in the tree. Depends on if I finish by the end of the episode. I don't expect to finish. So, yeah. I mean, the nether is probably going to take another episode. So, no, he'll have someone else with them. But, yeah, I'll do it at the end of the episode. Just... Leave a comment, subscribe, if it's nice, I'll add you. But yeah, currently episode 16 is like uploading. So yeah, I'll have someone by the end of the episode, just not now. I got this smelt in. And so I got this enchanted. I made a new grindstone, by the way. Um, I organized my inventory. These are the protection um enchantment books that i got and one has sweeping edge that's also going to go on my sword and then mending i, I just want to bring it to my house when i'm done with uh the dragon so i just brought it up here so it's separate i got the bows i'm going to combine and then yeah so i'm actually going to redo my boots i need feather falling I cannot live without feather falling. However, I gotta go fishing again. Alright, uh, I want this episode to be mainly about the nether. So I'm thinking that I'm just not gonna even do a time lapse. I'm just gonna cut it out. And then, j just so that you guys could have the enchanting and straight to the nether. Oh yeah, this platform was is built. I'm gonna put the portal right here. Okay. I'll see you guys when I'm done. Alright, I'm back. I got everything. Also, if you're wondering what happened to my shield, yeah, I was just swimming. I kind of just like, you know, like, how you like click a button and just switch off your offhand. Yeah, I switched it, and then I was, I don't know, my brain kind of like didn't comprehend that or whatever, or like how to switch it back. And then I clicked a couple of the wrong buttons, and then I accidentally dropped it, and then I just couldn't find it. So, yep, new shield. Anyways, that took me, like, a while to do. Maybe, like, an hour or whatever. Uh, yeah, it just took an hour, but I'm ready. I got cobblestone. I need gold. Taking the gold. I'm, I'm just going to make one set of boots for now. That should be fine. I'm not too concerned with the idea of falling. But yeah, I'm going to be trying to barter most of my gold so that, um, yeah, I'm going to, I don't want to look for a warp forest unless I come out right next to one. Um, otherwise, I'm just going to get the end of pearls by trading for them. I, I'm blocking that off. I can't do it when I'm in the portal. That is right. Uh, I got that biome. I got... Not the worst spawn. Got a little bit of gold. I am wearing it, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. What direction? No. No. <laughs> No, except for the part where there's an Enderman. Come here. Oh, yep. It made it to me. Ugh. I won. I got one Ender Pearl from it. Yeah. There's another one. Okay. Come on. Ender Pearls. Ender Pearls. Oh, you just give up after one hit? Okay, well, this looks like the easiest way to, like, go. 
It's got the most land. Oh, Enderman. I assume that would be the one I just fought. Or started to fight. Oh, fucking. Nope, it's not. It is not. It is not. Where are you? Sick. And there's another Enderman. How much did it drop? And I have five after three Endermen. Cool. That's just fantastic. Oh my god, that's even more fantastic. <laughs> I've been in here, what, three minutes? Fortress, Enderman, three of them. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, that is not how I was expecting it to go. I was expecting, like, okay, I get here. All right. Spend first hour and a half looking for fortress. Second hour almost dying in fortress. Oh, ooh, diamond. Okay. Another hour dying in fortress. But then, after that hour, gets seven braids rods. We're failing to get them. Okay, now leave his forest. Fortress. Looks for forest for an hour and a half. Does not find one. Commits to buying off of piglins. Completely fails. Spends it two hours not getting what he wants. Gives up. I was just expecting it to take like five hours to find the fortress. So far, this is a good start. Except for the part where I have, I don't see any blazes, which is kind of weird. I don't really see at least one by now. I mean, it hasn't been that long, but like, oh, cool, two. Is that two or is it three? It's three. I prefer to kill him with a sword that has looting. Ow, ow. Oh shit, fast. Nope. Nope. Fuck ghasts. Don't like them. So, wither skeletons, right? Nope. And I got six already. <laughs> I'm only aiming for like eight. Because I don't need brewing stands. I'm not sticking with where I'm at. Like, I'm going back to my house. I already have blaze powder at my house. I don't need that many more blaze blaze rods. I forgot their name for a second. I was about to say braze rods. In my defense, I'm used to saying brazing rod. Um. Yeah, anyways. I don't need them, so I only need eight. And technically, I only need six to make twelve, but I don't know how far away that fortress is going to end up. For all I know, it could end up ooh. For all I know, it could end up like fucking five thousand blocks away more. I hope not. I really don't want to spend an hour looking for it. Ooh, more gold. That will be helpful. I'll take three iron. I'm gonna leave that other one lonely in the chest. Perfect. How many I... I'm at ten. Alright, I'm leaving. That's it. I've killed five bright blazes. I'm out. Okay, going to trade with some, uh, whatever. What do you want to call them? Uh, what are they called? I don't even know. I see some over here, but I prefer to do it near the portal. Hell in here works. Can you like not? Okay, this is our little area. Hey, hello, sir. Can I have some ender pearls, please? <coughs> Fuck you, that's not ender pearls. 
Yes. My eight. I'm aiming for like 14. Okay, come on. More into pearls. Oh yeah. I will definitely keep that. That's coming back with me when I um go to what what you might call it, my actual house. Yeah, that's awesome. Come on. Need more ender pearls though. Okay, I'm all out of ingots and I guess I'm an idiot and didn't freaking grab my wood. So I can't even make a crafting table to uh, turn the rest into ingots. Okay, I got two from that. Yay! I'm kind of thinking about going to. Oh, shit! Uh. I was about to say, I'm kind of thinking about going and just like mining a bit of gold and then trading next to the portal. I'm definitely not going exploring for anything. Also, I have decided I don't want to get netherite. I don't know if I said that earlier, but it's not worth my time if I'm just going to have netherite the second I get back anyway. Okay, how many did you drop? Two. Yeah, I got ten. Yay. I mean, that's better. Oh. Get down here. I didn't even see you up there. Okay. Come on. Alright, so. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to waste time. Especially because I also have to go to a bastion. I don't want to go look for a bastion. I got lucky with the fortress. I'm not going to get that lucky twice. We all know I'm not. Come on. Get back down. Right, is that two endermen? I'm at 13. Oh, maybe I will get that lucky twice. See how lucky I'm getting with the freaking fortress and ender pearls. There, there I'm at. 15. I got 15 now. Okay. Sick. That's it. I'm done. I'm done with the nether. Huh. Okay. I can't. I kind of felt speedrun like just because the fact where I've been here 40 minutes and uh, I'm leaving that's not quite that much speedrun people are doing this in like fucking 30 seconds <laughs> I'm not doing it in that but I'm not doing it that fast speedrunning ain't fun to me but that that was absurdly lucky I, I've never been that lucky in my life I'm sorry, Gavin, but your sign's going to be over here. Actually, I guess it's cool for you because your sign's going to be in two places. Because I am going to put it back. But yeah, I'm not going to be here for the, end yet, for the end of the episode. So, no one else is coming here. <laughs> okay, so. I just went around, organized my inventory. I got a couple of blaze rods still. I got my smithing templates, the name tags, the enchantments I want to bring, some blocks, coal... Uh, the heart of the sea. I made a boat, a bucket. Yeah, I essentially just got stuff I want to bring back. Otherwise, I'm leaving it all the same. Is yeah, I I don't want this to like. I want it to be preserved, like for when I come back eventually. Like I will come back in a couple of years. Like it's bound to happen, and I don't know if I'll be in a nostalgic mood or whatever. Um. Yeah, it'll be nice to look at, though. It'd be cool if I'm just, like, wandering around, and then... Yeah, I just see it. Anyways, I'm gonna throw the first eye of Ender. It is... The exact way I'm facing. <laughs> that way. Cool, and it didn't break, either. Okay. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna get a move on. Alright. Bye, treehouse. See ya, in a long time screw you okay anyways I made a boat hopefully last time falling in there I've done that a couple times okay made a boat I'm hoping I don't get a lot of water on my way there I know there's a lot of water right here but I'm hoping it doesn't go on for that long hopefully it's mainly land 
and hopefully it's like 2,000 blocks away. Hell, hopefully it's 500 blocks away. I like how I said I'd be lucky if it wasn't mainly water and I just spent the majority of going about 2,500 blocks in water. <laughs> yeah, that sucked. I did lose one on the way there. Um, or on the way here, I guess. But, yeah, it's still not, like, right above me. I, yeah, my... My base was approximately at the coordinates, like, negative 27,000. I'm at negative 24,000 now. So, yeah, it's, it's been a while. And still going. I'm starting to see a cherry biome. And, yeah, I've gone about... 2,000 more blocks, or 1,500, or whatever. I've gone far. Yeah, luckily, I didn't lose another one this time. Because, yeah, I got three extra, but I'm kind of scared there's not going to be any, and I'm going to lose, like, four. That would suck. Then I'd be one short. I got to go look for another Enderman. I got to wait 15 nights for one to actually spawn. That, that would suck. I know they spawn, like, every night. But since I'm looking for one, it'd take like 15 days. No, real days, not Minecraft days. Anyways, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna come up here and throw another one, just because I haven't thrown one in like 800 blocks. I am okay. Yeah, I am still going in the right direction. Oh, huh. okay. I haven't actually been to one of these in Java. Looks nice. I kind of like like the different shade of grass here. Yeah. I have one of these saplings. I know I do. Do I? Eh. Yeah, I got one more. It's good enough. I don't need a lot. I'm not planning on building that much out of cherry. Oh, uh, I was just thinking in my head, though. I, I'm, like, excited to be able to just glide off this mountain. That's why I was sprinting at it, like, I'm ready to jump right here, but nope, don't add my elytra. Fan freaking tastic. At this point, I kind of feel like I should be throwing them like a little bit more often. I've only gone like 200 blocks. I'm throwing another one. Just because, yeah, I've been traveling for a while. You like. Like, I gotta fucking start throwing them more. I gotta be close. Again. I passed it. Yes. I'm close. Give. Okay, it was pointing at this island. Do I go with the lonely tree? I think it's under the lonely tree. I mean, it's only one tree. Gotta be it. Huh. If it is under here, can I see it? Nope, that is not that deep. Not even a chance of seeing it. Hey, it's pointing to the island. Might be here. It's the other one I was like there and shot this way. This time I was here and shot this way, so I'd say they intersect, like, here, this birch tree. This oak tree. I got it. I'm finding it. Yeah, I do want to quickly apologize. This might be a shorter episode. Yeah, this is meant to be like a three-part thing, not a two-part one where the first one's like... A lot that happens in the video than this one where just a couple things happen. <laughs> like, oh, yep, came, oh, cave. It's not expecting that. Um, uh, yeah, a little bit happened. Like, I didn't do a lot. I went to the nether for like 15 minutes. Ugh. Freaking zombies. I'm, I'm just trying to avoid, like, even fighting them. And great, there's three mobs. I'm going this way. It's in here. Ooh. Another ender pearl. That'd be useful. There's another chest. That is the portal. That is great. Eh, that 
I mean, like, it's somewhat good. It's got efficiency on it. Uh, I'm gonna break that. Portal. And, yeah, I was right. It didn't have any. Of course it didn't. Okay. I'm going to make that. Put in those. And there. And, okay. I'm gonna put in all of these. It's nerve-wracking. Okay. And there. Okay. Before I go in, I did see a light at the bottom of these stairs, yeah. Okay, it's just that, but I still want to see what's down here. Okay, I'm happy I'm seeing what's down here. Sick. No, I got some eye armor trim. Uh. Did I get the silence trim when I was in the ancient city in this world? I'm not sure. What's in this one? Got this. Eh, that's shitty. I will definitely take that. For some reason, I read that as piercing six for a second, like, the, after I pulled away. I read it as sharpness four, took my cursor away, then it was like, wait, sharpness six? Or piercing six? Okay. I have no intention of exploring anything else. Wait, what is down here? Nope, not going in the cave. Okay. Nerve-wracking. Just gonna block that off. Oh yeah, and before I forget, I gotta set my spawn, like, away from here. And then, like, away from the treehouse. Oh yeah, I guess I did sleep multiple times on the way here, but... Still good to double-check that I'm not gonna, like, teleport back to the treehouse when I'm done with the dragon fight. Yeah, that would suck. I don't want to have to run back to the stronghold, and I'm especially not running back to my fucking house. That's 27,000 blocks away, plus the 10,000. Okay. Nerve-wracking. Let's... Wait a minute. Let's just wait a minute. Okay, nope, let's do it. This was supposed to be replaced. My bad. I wasn't supposed to have that here. Okay. Let's do it. Alright, I'm going to try and edit out the least amount as possible, but... I mean, like, when I'm just running around shooting arrows at the dragon, it's not going to be that entertaining. I might just do what I did with, like, the cow montage last video, where it's just, like, every single time I hit it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, first try with that one. Can I hit this one from here? I'm not even sure about that one. Please, maybe, potentially, hit it. Come on. There we go. But yeah, you might just see me hitting the dragon over and over again with an arrow. Like, otherwise it's just going to be me running in circles missing. Hopefully not missing. It'd be nice if I just, like, didn't miss ever again. Yeah, I'm not used to the drop from this bow, because on bedrock, arrows don't drop, like, at all. So, I've kind of gotten used to that, but when I played on Pocket Edition for multiple years of my life, it was like this, and I was really good with it. Then Bedrock came. Oh yeah, and Xbox 360. And it was like this. And then Bedrock came. And then now I'm good with Bedrock, and I'm not good with this anymore. Which really sucks. Oh, okay. That did answer my question. There was one up here. I didn't ask out loud, but I was thinking it. Ow. Okay. I still didn't hit it. Come on. Almost hitting it. Almost there. Come on. I'm so happy I have infinity on my bow. Also flame, just because I could see where I like hitting. There we go. Okay. That's all the that's all the pillars. <laughs> this is fucking easy. Yeah. I'll eventually fight the wither again. It's way easier than on bedrock. And yeah, it's not like yeah, when you fight the Wither after the Ender Dragon, it makes sense that I can have all that, like, netherite by then. 
It makes sense. So, yeah, I'm not gonna complain too much that I have all the netherite by the time I'm there. This is so nice, by the way, with the ender dragon. Like, normally in bedrock, it's, like, brain damaged or something to where I'll be looking up like this, shooting arrows, and then I got six endermen chasing me. Now, now I got nothing after me. It's nice. Huh? Confusion? Yeah, this is all still here. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Holy. I wasn't expecting that. Knocked me far, or she knocked me far, whatever. I did MLG it, but it wasn't that from that high up. I'm surprised I couldn't even do that, because how I'm sitting, like, um, I, I'm so stretched, like, away from my table. Or, not table, it's a desk. Like, I'm so stretched away from it to where my mouse is practically at the bottom of my desk. Like, if I move it more than two inches, then I gotta, um, like, pick it up and then lift it, move it up further, and then keep looking down. Which kind of sucks, especially because for that MLG thing. Oh, I just hit that right in front of them. I've never done that. Ah, oh, do I have glass bottles? I need dragon breath. I mean, I don't need it, but I kind of want it. But yeah, I had to like move my mouse. I had to pick my mouse up, move it up, and then swipe down and then do it. So I'm surprised I even got it off. Die, die. Enderman, attack. Whoa. I didn't get it off that time. I'm going back in. This is smart. Come on. Where do I have to hit? Throw. Right. Jesus Christ. Stop hitting me that far back. Come on. Come on. I'm almost there. Whoa. Come on. Come on. Last hit. Just don't be in the portal. Yes! I got her. Completely hardcore. Which is nice. Oh, I just remember you don't get a lot of XP from respawning it anymore. Just dumb. Okay. I did it. Yay! That disappointed me though. I don't get a dragon egg, I don't get XP. However, I do get to go back home. So that's exciting. Here I am. Uh, you know, I just like accidentally clicked on my first video. And um Yeah, I started watching it. I, I just got like seven minutes through. I don't like watching myself that much. It's kind of weird. But I'm pretty sure my spawn was like right here. <laughs> yeah, like by this mushroom, but then I went like that way and started digging here, didn't I? Yeah, I did start mining here at first. And then I failed to get out of this water. Mine all the way through there, I guess. No, I think that was just a cave there that I ignored. Yeah, that's from the actual like first episode, not the like first, like the first time I fought the dragon, not the Second, first time I fought the dragon now. Okay, I'm pretty sure my house is this way. Never mind, I am pretty sure my house is this way. Okay, maybe it's this way. I'm lost. In my defense, I don't die often. I don't, I don't show up at the spawn, like, too usually. So, yeah, I got no idea where I'm at. Yay! Okay, I'm pretty sure it's on this side of this mountain. If I'm not mistaken. I probably am judging by the last couple of times. Okay, I'm back at spawn, which I'm pretty sure is like 0-0 zero, zero, since I switched to bed. Not to bedrock. From bedrock to Java. 
And I'm pretty sure it's in this direction. Jeez, I did not expect this. <laughs> I'm home. Yes, cannonball. Misses, dies to fall damage. <laughs> okay. I wonder, are they still in here? They are. Is there... Nope. None of them are Marcifer. Has he been standing there the whole time? Oh my god. So, don't go to the one on the floor. What's up? Yeah. Maybe just none of them will ever leave. I don't know. Okay. I wonder where Marcifer is. I feel like he's not in his house still. I feel like he's still looking around. <laughs> Testing out other houses, I guess. He's not in this one still. What's he doing? Maybe he's not a fisherman anymore. That would be nice. You in here? Nope. Oh, for God's sake. So, okay. I was about to say, please say you weren't a farmer. <laughs> Just because it'd be probably not worse than the fisherman, but it'd still look ugly. But don't walk away from me. Hey, how you been? Huh. Uh, yeah, well, essentially, I got rid of my extra lives. You know, I normally have infinite lives or whatever. Huh. Were you mad at me because I said it looked ugly? Oh my god. Um, yeah, I got rid of them. I'm on hardcore now. And I didn't... Oh, of course you're going to bed. <laughs> you keep this again. <laughs> uh. Okay, well, I didn't want people saying that I didn't beat the Ender Dragon on Hardcore because I died on Bedrock. So I got rid of all my stuff, responded, and beat it. Yeah, thanks, dude. Alright, I'm going to get changed. Uh, I don't like this outfit. I, I like mine. And then, yeah, I got to add someone to the Connoisseur Cove and end the video. But then I guess I'll like hang out in the village for a bit. Alright, see you later. Oh my god, I gotta take the stairs. Stairs, oh my god. <laughs> so weird. I don't have a trap door in front of that lamp. Oh no, I do. Okay. Okay. I thought I didn't. Give me a heart attack there. Thought we were all gonna, like, die. Gonna lose my only life. Okay, I got the stuff I wanna keep. And they're all in chests now. I am changing into this armor. Because, yeah, I, I don't want it here. So, I'm going to put that here. I'm going to get my tools. And then, oh my god, I can't wait to fly again. Um, I don't have any smooth stone in here. And I need smooth stone. I'm going to make a armor. Um, what's it called? Armor stand. But I need smooth stone. It's all in Marcifer's house, so I gotta go grab that. And yeah, I'm gonna make the armor stand. Okay. I'm gonna put this on display in my room. It's like a trophy or whatever. I got that as a trophy for the first time. This is a trophy for the second time. It's like a memory. Stay in my room forever. I mean, this is only like a starter base, so eventually it's gonna move with me, but. Otherwise, technically, it's staying here forever in my room. Um, put that in. Got the inventory from when I beat it. Everything can go in there. And then, and that's about it from the hardcore switch. Happy I did that. I have a jukebox up here? Is there anything in it? No. I don't know why I came up here. I don't even know I had that up there. Okay. So, anyways. I gotta add someone to the cove. So, I'm gonna do that real quick. Okay, I'm here. And, yeah, here's Paul Hervey. And I'm going to add Gavin. Uh, what is it? Dinkleby. Oh, I can't. It won't let me type anymore. Okay. I'm just going to add like a dash 
And then another dash and put Dingleby here. I did not know that I couldn't fit as much on these signs. Anyways, the next person I'm adding, the last one for the video, is Ocean Blue. And they just said that it's a nice world and just keep up the work. And thank you for the comment. And welcome to the Connoisseur Cove. Okay. Alright, that's about the end of the video. So, I just want to say thank you for watching. If you ended up actually watching till the end. And I will see you in the next video where I'm back to normal. And I think I'm doing a gold farm.